it's been a rough past week, but I am back. We are recovering from the C word. So to be honest, I'm really not concerned. So like baby's very healthy. He's been so active these past couple of days. So far, I'm not, is that something? We're gonna start picking up this house. Are you gonna help me? No. No, rude. So I just hung these um, on her wall so she can wear these throughout the week. <laughs> talking to yourself? <laughs> What? What is mom doing? <laughs> Ty is picking up the food. Can't even explain why it's so good. It just is. Maybe it's pregnancy. I don't know. <laughs> we also have some lottery tickets here. <laughs> Woo! I woke up so hungry. It is 7.30 in the morning and I'm making oatmeal before coffee even. I'm so hungry. I love this oatmeal by the way. It's the steel cut, um, what's it called? Better Oats, I think. And it's so yummy. It's Sunday, Scarlett's still sleeping, Ty's still sleeping, Andy's still sleeping. It's been a rough past week, but I am back and feeling so much better. I don't sound better yet, but I'm feeling better. <coughs> Good morning, we are recovering from the C word. I don't know if I can say it on YouTube anymore. My entire family, well, mine is Scarlett, so Ty. <laughs> Ty and I, we had it, and um, this is our second time having it, so thankfully it was not near as bad as it was round one, but it's still not fun to have. It was like a really, really bad cold for me, and I mainly had like congestion, sore throat, a cough, um, that kind of thing. When I had it the first time, I had a fever for literally over 10 days and it was rough. This time I barely spiked a fever and it was for maybe half of a day. So it definitely was not near as bad as it was when we had it last year. We've been staying home and in the house we bought a Nintendo Switch and we've been playing Mario Kart and it's been um, weirdly nice like canceling all plans and just like chilling with the family. Scarlett was losing her mind, but other than that, like it's it's not been that bad. I was still testing positive as of yesterday, but it was very faint. And when this happened to Ty, cause he's like in the clear now, the next day his was negative. So I'm really hoping today mine's negative. I'm gonna have to take a test and see. But I've been talking to you guys over on Instagram. I shared what was going on and so many of you guys were like, you can test positive for months. And I had no idea. Like I thought you're supposed to wait until you have a negative test, but I, I cannot keep up on everything that changes. Also, I'm almost 20 weeks pregnant and um, I've been getting a lot of questions asking about like, is our doctor taking any precautions? Or like, is there anything I have to do being pregnant having the C word and my doctor says no my doctor is like not concerned I'm honestly not concerned like I I feel like everything's fine I asked you guys again on Instagram and probably like 75% of the people are like yeah we didn't do anything differently and then there's like that small percentage who are like we had weekly ultrasounds somebody was like I was considered high risk but I think there's so many other things that factor into all of that too so my doctor just told me to take zinc and vitamin D and vitamin C and baby aspirin and he said he'd see me at my next appointment so to be honest I'm really not concerned um, it's the last thing I'm worrying about right now. I feel like baby's very healthy. He's been so active these past couple of days, which is so exciting. I feel him move all the time and it's the most magical feeling ever. Also probably should have left this alone. I self tanned last night, so I'm looking a little crazy. I feel like, I don't know if the camera's picking it up. I need a shower. Today I'm gonna put on some makeup, make myself feel a little bit more like myself because I've just been so out of it this past week. Okay. Same spot, but I have um, put on a little bit of makeup, which has not happened for a very long time. Scarlett's back here. What is wrong? She keeps saying, I'm bored, I'm bored. One, two, three. Please be negative. 
I will say immediately when I take these tests, there's been a positive like immediately. So far, I'm not, is that something? I feel like there might be a faint line there still. Dang it. What kind of lines are they? You see that red line? Don't get too close. A red line. See oh. that? Yeah. Actually, is it negative? I can't tell. Yeah, I can't tell. I haven't had symptoms for, I don't know, since last week. And now I'm just like recovering from the congestion and the sore throat. You're gonna hit me in the face with that? You want me to show you how that works? Oh. Yeah, I'm not very good at it. Definitely still positive. Dang it. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm fine to leave the house now. It's been, um, well, today's my 10th day. So, I mean, according to the CDC, I think it's only five days at home, five days with a mask, something like that. So I'm pretty sure I'm like fine, but I have no reason to leave. So we're just gonna keep staying home, but that sucks. I was really hoping it'd be negative today. So yes, it's still testing positive. It is what it is. I'm on day 10 right now, so um, hopefully, it I don't know, maybe it won't. <laughs> like so many of you guys were like, I tested positive for months. Um, so whatever, I mean, it is what it is. We'll test again tomorrow. I have one more test left and I'm not buying anymore. So I feel better not having symptoms. Um, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know. Scar's over here having some breakfast. She's eating, what are you eating? Uh, French, French toast. toast sticks and watching puppy dog pals. She has this little puppy she's been, where's your puppy at? Right here. Oh. She just gave him a bath and some water. <laughs> so cute. Say good morning. Yes, we got a new couch too. I'll be sharing it soon in a future video, probably next week. still in love with the Daily Harvest smoothies. Um, this is the blueberry chocolate. We're gonna start picking up this house. Are you gonna help me? No. No, rude. What? Kids don't have to do it. But they do, you have chores. You can't boss them around to do it. Well, if you want privileges, you need to help me. What privileges do you mean? That means like doing fun things. iPad time. Video game time, oh my gosh. friend time. <laughs> what is my hair today? Like I put it on makeup, but this hair is not not getting done. Oh my gosh, what is happening? All right, I'm just gonna do Pikachu. How do you play Pikachu? No, like remember that game I played? Oh, Kirby. Yeah, Kirby. Yes, you can play Kirby. Let's go turn it on. Guys, the Nintendo Switch is so fun. We've been like, it's been so nostalgic for Ty and I. It's so fun! And it's cool Nintendo teaching Switch. her about all of these like retro games like Nintendo 64 and like we've been playing Super Mario Brothers and Kirby! She's and playing Mario Kirby, Kirby, which is, I think it's an updated version, Wait. but. Mom? Huh. I just missed you my stroke. <laughs> so we got her My Little Pony. That was like her Nintendo 64 game and she already beat it. Yeah. So I think it was way too easy for her. I thought it was like an age appropriate game, but she already beat the game. <laughs> or can I do it again? I mean, we could start it over. Yeah, we could reset the game. You could play it again. Oh, yay. I think, I mean, I don't know how to do that. I'm sure daddy does, but yeah, anyways, I'm just gonna let her play okay, and go pick up because Kirby. sometimes it's just easier. Just yeah, I'll turn it on for you. And then mommy's gonna do some house cleaning, okay? Before anyone comes after me and is like, you should make her clean up her room herself, or you should make her clean up her playroom herself. Cause I always get that when I pick up her space. Um, yeah, you're right. <laughs> I probably should. You're not wrong. <laughs>
I just grabbed some new rompers from Old Navy for Scarlett too. Ordered these online. She's kind of in between wearing like a 5T to wearing like the big kid girl's size. Um, but these were super cute and so easy for summer. She's wearing this in gray today. So we also got a gray one. This is the pink one. This one seems like it's a little small but I think it'll be fine for summer. And then I loved this little terry cloth one. I think it's just so cute. So I just hung these um, on her wall so she can wear these throughout the week. This dress is also from Old Navy. Just made Scarlett some lunch. She's having a ham and cheese sandwich, strawberries, and pirate's booty. Loading up in the car. Let me start the car real quick so you guys are. Thank you. I appreciate that. It's probably only 110. It's gonna be hot today. Let me see. Let me see. Is it? Let me see. Yeah, all weekend it's supposed to be really hot. It's 107 out right now, but it's supposed to be 110. I think yesterday was 113. Um, anyways, we are getting out of the house for a little bit um, and simply driving to fill up my car with gas. Ty's gonna fill my car up. And oh, you have your cam up. I was like, talking to yourself? <laughs> you know, I'm just saying you're talking to myself. <laughs> Scarlett's back there. I was there. like, what? What? What is mom doing? <laughs> um. Anyways, we're, so we're doing that. We're going to get gas. Ty's making fun of me. And um, we ordered barbecue from Joe's Real Barbecue in downtown Gilbert. It's It's been one of my favorite things recently they have this baked potato and their baked potato is so good and I just like load it up and put like their barbecue beans on it it's so delicious so they have like a drive up window where you just pick it up like you order online and then you just oh you're talking about the food. yeah it's like not a drive up but like it's a window like you have to get out of your car but you like park right there I don't know it's really easy um and yeah, it's simple good. yeah it's so good so we are going to do that do I like it Mm -hmm. I got you a ham sandwich, even though you've already had lunch. Mom, this what? is all box. Every every single one in my school likes odd bots. Odd bots? Yeah, that's odd. Everybody cool. does. Every single person, huh? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, your Amazon was delivered. I forgot. Do we need to get it? No, it's okay. I ordered her a first grade workbook so we can start working on some first grade work mm -hmm. before school starts because believe it or not, it is June, but school starts next month in July. Um, we start next first grade in July, which is, next sounds month crazy. I go to but it's school. so hot out that there's, there's really next no point of them being out of school for yeah. summer. Yeah, kids here start school in July, but they have bigger breaks throughout the year. So I think it's called a track school. No, it's called year round because tracks when you're on different tracks. Um, I was on a track school in Colorado actually. What is, it, what is the track school? So like we had like A track and B track and C track. I think we had a D track too. And so A track kids and C track kids would go to school together and then they'd be off and then the other track would be on. Like B track and D track would be on or something like that. Hmm. So basically you're alternating kids. Like you'd go to school for six weeks and then you'd be off for like four weeks. What? Um, That's weird. Yeah, it was really weird. I don't know. I didn't really like it because they switched me tracks and then I, like, cause I was a new kid, so they like switched my track and then I had to make all new friends because I never got to see those friends at school, yeah. if that makes sense. But I think it's just a way to like, 
Like there were so many kids and they were trying to yeah, accommodate. accommodate. Yeah. yeah. Accommodate. As I was saying, yeah, she started school in July, but that's just normal for the kids out here. Um, so we literally go to Kansas. Well, I'm taking her to Kansas, dropping her off at my parents, getting on a plane the next day, heading to New York, meeting him in New York. Mm -hmm. And then we are going from New York to Italy and then meeting our friends in Italy. We'll be there for nine days. And then I'll fly back to Kansas. He'll fly back to Arizona. I'll pick her up. We come back to Arizona. And then like a couple days later, she starts school. So our summers are really, really short here. We just pulled up. Ty is picking up the food, ready to eat. And you're bored. Are you hungry? Yeah. Do you want some barbecue? No. Got the goods. Now home to destroy these meals. So hungry. We just got home. Scarlett got invited to a neighbor's house to play in like the water in the backyard. So Ty's actually running her over there right now. And I'm going to sit down to eat. This is Ty's sandwich. I think this is mine because it's super heavy. Yeah. So we have a baked potato, side of beans. I also got some corn. I'm so excited to eat this. This must be Scarlet's, which I'm just going to save for her for dinner. She already had lunch anyways. So... Um, yeah, I'm just gonna save this. I am so happy right now. <laughs> this looks so good. I can't even explain why it's so good. It just is. Maybe it's pregnancy. I don't know. I'm trying to edit in the moment today because this vlog's going up tomorrow, but I'm starting to feel crappy again, which sucks. Um, it's like I was feeling really good as like when I woke up and throughout the day, but I'm not really feeling that great right now. Just like really tired. It's so hard to know if it's like symptoms. I don't know what's going on with my hair. <laughs> it's so hard to know if it's from um, the C word <laughs> or pregnancy. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Are you watching my vlog? Can I help you with that? I don't like what you're doing with the scissors. <laughs> this is the first, yeah, this is the first grade workbook we got Scarlett. Hi again. As requested oh, by Scarlett. Oh, look at that. Can I show them it? Sure. Oh, they have these? Yeah, so it'll be easier to open. Yes. Your teacher? Maybe maybe tonight we can sit down and do it? Uh, yes, ma'am. I'm not a ma'am. <laughs> ma'am. You call me sir. Yes, ma'am. This looks good. I think you're going to love this. Yeah. Anyways, we just bought this on Amazon. Wait, can I, can I tell you The big first grade. What's it by? School zone? Wait, wait, come I need, what? I need to tell you a secret. Can you, can you tell me a secret? What this was from? Because I want to tell the Amazon. This was from Amazon. And these are the other books that you can get. And we also have some lottery tickets here. <laughs> <laughs> and How much money did we win? $100. Yeah, it went $100. We got to turn them in. <laughs> you are in a good mood. Hi, guys. Before we get started, click on that subscribe and turn on the notification and give me a huge thumbs up. So, what am I thinking? If you don't know what these are, they are really good. Let me just try to open these really quick. It's going to take a second. Sorry, it's just really, really hard. It's these. I have six of them. I'll show you what there are inside. Oh, I got I missed one right here. These right. I don't think you can see them. If you see them really closely, hold on. If you don't know what these candies are, I'm just showing you. I just got these at the gas station, but they might be a little blurry. That's okay. <laughs> Why? She said, can you please put this in the video? <laughs> All right, done. You want to be a blogger? Yeah. Is that what you want to be when you grow up as a blogger? 
Yes, I want to be a mom, a vlogger, and a lolly co. And you want to sell lolly co? Can you please open this? <laughs> yes. It just keeps shutting. You want to be just like mom and dad? Yeah. There you go. But I will have a, I will have a crush. Then. Who's your crush? Tanner. Oh, Tanner <laughs> Beeston. <laughs> No, Easton, that's a crush on No, me. his last name's Beeston. Uh-oh. Tiffany's son. I thought you said Easton. Yeah, you guys had fun when he was here, huh? But Easton has a crush on me. He's my friend at school. Why do you have a crush on Tanner? What made you like him? Because when I was at his house, well, when we were in the hot tub, Whoa, he was... Okay. <laughs> okay? So what? He was, Sorry. He was bossing us around with... Some uh, food. Tanner was. Yeah. And you, you that made you like him. Mhm. Mm <laughs> they live in Transylvania. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. I keep forgetting. <laughs> it's a Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Pens <laughs> it's pencil like. She. Pencil. When the Beastons came to visit, her and Tanner apparently hit it off. <laughs> Okay, anyways, I'm going to end this vlog. I'm still not feeling 100%. No, and definitely not end this vlog. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. <laughs> bye. Bye. Bye, 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 bye.